Yeah, that pyro swap. I thought it was gonna be another mirror match, um, assassin, pathfinder, shaman, but it wasn't. Do you think it did switch to pyromancer? And I want to say he was probably the the number one damage dealer for that for that round. And running the same comps again. Nothing changed up. Some good wall uh, jumping from Rethink's team there by Y. Yeah. To get ahead. You know, Oh, I like have Bolo, Bolo really attacking aggressively. Snorlax immediately, taking him into the Shadow Realm. Yeah, there puts is a, a trap bubble. down. Why, why, that, why, it is picking up on have Bolo. Huge flame Huge wall goes flame down. Huge flame wall, wow. Yeah, Rethink now putting the pressure onto Fox wow, with that they're not storm. messing around. Lots of pyro moves here. Yeah, why should have his trap up again, so... I believe that might have been it. Um, I don't know if that was his trap or the enemy Pathfinders. Snorlax... Getting pressured, Simulator was trying to push in on him. Now why getting shot in the back? He needs to kind of regroup with his team. If he does get Assassin stunned in that position, he could pay for it. Firestorm going down by Rethink. It does land. And a Curse of Flame as well. Oh, man, big curse. Uh, a lot of damage going out. Fox doing a phenomenal job healing this up. Snorlax getting pretty much ignored. I really like that. You know, when your DPS is such a problem and in their face for the enemy team and you don't get targeted, that's Perfect for you, oh, for you as a shaman. I want to see a buff go out. They really, he can kind of tilt the flow of battle in more favor of his team if he can get a shaman buff out. Fox desperately trying to heal. Rethink gonna go for that firestorm. Does get stunned, so that is getting canceled. There goes the flame wall. Uh, it's right over Butch's feet. Butch is the bear in the middle, and have Bolo. The bear there. Yes. <laughs> Bolo getting focused again. Why trying to pick him up with that volley spam into the corners, but have Bolo juked that. And now we're gonna see why becoming the main focus. He does get stun trapped and rethink as well. Oh, Snorlax is all over it though with the healing. I mean, he's been doing such an impressive job uh, in this match. Just, just exactly why you were saying DPS getting in the Yeah, is and Fox gonna him. be able to do an impressive job as well? Have Bolo it. What is it? I believe he was at 5% for a second there. Oh, Fox yeah. Really trying to heal him up, keeping him around the 20% mark. He just can't get him above 50. Looks like we might see that happen, though. Have Bolo doing a great job blocking. I need to see him get some type of damage out. Looks like he's targeting Rethink. Wow, he's Rethink is of, very low there. Oh, there he's goes the Molten Armor. Simulator absolutely demolishing himself. Oh, Hit all those Molten Armor shots. Molten Doesn't armor. even care. Doesn't wow, even care. He takes him Rethink. down. Rethink's gone. Wow, this is really impressive. Have Bolo just able to survive. Fox able to help heal his team. Simulator was like, all right, guys, I'll clean this up. I'm getting the pyro. I'm taking them out. Yeah, I mean, they put they really put the team to work there and made it happen. That's what they needed to do. Now, why going to do all he can for his team? Snorlax definitely needs heals. Have Bolo should be able to jump onto him. Simulator getting stunned. Have Bolo as well. Have Bolo will get a restealth here. There's the re-stealth. He is going to, to Shadow Leap stun, I believe. He did Shadow Leap. He missed the stun. However, so Y got stun trapped. Alive. There he goes. Drops. And now it's only Y left. Some more key wall jumps. And uh, was, that a, was that a K? I think it was. Looks like it was. Yeah. So it's now 1-1 one, one between both teams. wonder if they're going to change anything up. We oh, are on Hulk Walk Arena. Here too. This is, as I said earlier, this is known to be the pyro map. You have a lot of different uh, height advantages that you can achieve by using that flame burst to take the high ground. Oh, absolutely. This should be very interesting. Indeed, the, Alec. Uh, catwalks up here. So do you, I'm, I'm going to give you the chance to change it up. What do you think? You know, are you still sticking with... Fox's team, or are we going with Rethink now? I'm sticking with my answer. Uh, yeah, I think I'm, st I'm going to stay with Fox's team. They've yeah. uh, been showing some great game here. Yeah, Rethink got a huge... You know, that's really crazy. Why switch it up to Ravager? This is, oh, this is wow. interesting. I've never seen Y play as Ravager before. This uh, I haven't bode seen well him play Ravager too much as well, other than just for fun. Looks like he did get a grapple in. He's going to knock everyone around. Trying to get back to Rethink, he needs to help his Shaman, Snorlax, gonna stand his ground. He needs to turn around. Rethink up, please. There you go. 
And why playing? He is in wheel chain. He's not going to be able to block. So if a stun trap does go down, there it was. Um, right now, who are you following in on? I don't know who you I you're... just went from uh, Y. I'm over at Fox now, showing them healing and staying with their team. Their whole team's very close, but Y is right in there as the Ravager trying to put down goes the down a Huge flame, flame wall. wall. Y getting shadow shifted. He is the focus of the assassin. The assassin getting some really good damage off onto him. Y gonna go wheel chain now. It looks like they caught Symbol later. If that curse hits for full damage, it didn't hit for full damage, but still quite a bit. Have Bolo. Trying to single out the healer again. Snorlax is like, you know what? I don't care. My team is heal here. I will heal up. But can he heal his team as well? Looks like Y is pretty low. A huge... More uh, flame walls. I'm loving it. Yeah, more flame walls. That's really the key component of how you can play Pyro. Um, y getting pressured really hard. Looks like a Molten Armor going down for Rethink as well. Something big needs to happen here, otherwise, I believe Rethink's team is going to go down. Yeah, the health I mean, their advantage. health is all very low. Snorlax is trying to do what he can, but Rethink's at 23% there, and that Pathfinder is just laying into him. Yeah, kind of back and forth, a shot at Snorlax, a shot at Rethink, whoever he wants to hit. Snorlax, Snorlax extremely low, very 1%. Low, and he's going to... Uh, oh, a huge bubble. Huge bubble. He had the Assassin he gated and a lot the of damage. How? on him. He's still down at like 8%, 7%. 5%, he does get picked up. They could get a counter kill here. Looks like... No, Hevbola did a great job. He got a... Yeah, very... Hayabola is very effective. Great work. Super effective, I should say. <laughs> so right now, rethinking oh, why Destiny. Oh no, no, rethink still is 4%. I spoke too soon. But he's down there with Hayabola. What's gonna happen there? He's still alive. And he drops, that's it. Wow, right. Fox's team. I mean, we called it, that's all. Called it, we're psychic. That's all I can really say, I guess. Predicting the future since... Uh, uh, called it early on. Uh, so uh, I guess let's do this update. And now it's probably gonna be Titch versus Fox again. All right, and this will like be the finals. Time. Big win for Fox's team. So if, Tit, or if uh, Titch's team can join up on the server that I'm on now, we can get this started. And these are the beginning of the finals. For the finals, we always do best of five. Until now, we've been doing best of three. So this uh, it gives you a better feel for like how the teams are playing that day. Um, <clears throat> and uh, to celebrate, I'm going to change my background from the newsroom Two, let's see what else I have. What do you have, Alex? Oh, look at that. Look at that. I even have a plant in the background. People used to love the plants I had. So I put a special plant. plant you can see Dark Veil. Dark Veil Games logo <laughs> up above the top of the room. And this is, uh, you know, it's like I'm living the high life here. This is crazy. Yeah, man. I've got this whole studio now at my disposal. Very exciting. Very exciting stuff. So let's see. Do we have the players in the game here? It looks like we, you know, Titch just has to K out, and then we can go live. Let's, uh... Okay, there we go. Save. Let's go to next Save. map. Let's let's go ahead and start fresh on a fresh map. Sounds like a good call. Alright, man. So, liking the green screen you got there, man. Yeah, it's pretty fancy. I don't know. What can I say? Can All I right, say? and now uh, we begin. I'm here following Fox's team. I we are just gonna oh, get no, the next map. Out. No, never mind. Not beginning yet. Uh, gonna get the next map in the rotation. Let's see a little bit more of this green screen here, so you can see this whole room that I'm in. It's so expansive, uh, and just filled with this these these woods that are exotic, and uh, you know something that Will Ferrell would appreciate. Of course, of course. Oh man, do you think do you think we're gonna see some knockoffs here? That's why I wanted to go to the next map. I wanted to uh Ooh, Titch a little. A yeah, little. Titch is a little aggressive there. Yeah, always. I don't know if his mom would like that. I, I suspect not. As do I. All right, Hopefully let's she's not see. watching. So here I am following Fox's team. 
uh, is putting out some heals. Looks like he's doing some M1s. Not sure what that's all about. <laughs> Both teams just sitting in the back. They're just like, okay, who's who's running at who? Are we going outside? I, uh, yeah, I mean, I um, want to see Fox's team lure them out. We've got this uh -huh. huge cliff here. Players can just go flying off of it. It looks like Immortal Step is moving in, and we do have Immortal Step back on the Ravager with Titch. Uh, worked really well throughout the tournament. Have Bolo oh, on Assassin. Oh, the team is kind of separated here. I have yeah, Bolo, Bolo immediately. <laughs> Brings their shaman into the shadow world. That shaman did use burden to increase his jump height and get out of there. The dogs getting pressured really hard. Oh. Simulator trying to move in. Who's more aggressive, Titch or Simulator in this matchup? Yeah, really, Amazing. really impressive. Uh, right now, Fox doing a great job healing. Uh, if he can pick up have Bolo as well, looks like they did a little bit of line of sighting. That might cost them. However, Dead Dogs get stunned. If they oh, can simulate it, if he can get some more damage. 8%, 7%, 7%, 7%, and... Uh, wow, still alive. Now, drops. is able to pick drops. him up. Wow. Brutal. Amazing. And now have... And now we're outside. Another one but down. Immortal Step is very low. Yeah, nothing he can do there. Wow, Fox's team brutalized them there. Didn't lose a single, per a single player. That was epic. Really close. I thought something, if if a stun explosive trap could have went down into uh, BD Fox when it kind of LOS'd him a bit, he missed two heals because they ran just around the corner. If a stun or some kind of CC would have went onto Fox, that could have been, uh, could have been the defeat for his team, but it wasn't. He was able to uh, heal up and he didn't get CC'd, so oh, it's so now one Opal of running in. I'm seeing Immortal Step. Trying to put some grappling hooks out there. Yeah, I'm uh, I'm really glad to see have Bolo playing Sin. A lot of players who will play Sin for a couple matches but not stick with it throughout the entire tournament. He has stuck with Assassin throughout every round and very proficient at it. So right now, I, we're going to see a knockoff, Alec. We're going to see I one. I hope so. I mean, I, I hope they're listening to us. I'm Just gonna so that go they ahead can and call make it. our wishes come true. Mortal Step is going to either hook pull someone, or Titch is going to camo swap someone, and Immortal Step is gonna knock them off. Looks like he's gonna go for it right now. It's not enough distance, Alec. Oh not no! Not enough distance. And Simulator getting healed up by Fox. Fox having to move in. He does get a no. He did try and get a spiritual drain off. That would have drained the enemies. Um, Energy, if he did link to them, he did not get that off. Uh, Bolo looks like he's doing as much pressure as he can, being very aggressive. He does get knocked away quite a bit. And Simulator, I think he's going to push in here. Uh oh. Uh oh, that right could at be, the end. Oh, that could be. I, I saw oh, that coming, no. Alec. And I didn't know what. To, I said, uh oh, but I didn't know how to call that. There was a swap onto Simulator, and they did try for another knockoff. They didn't get it. Yeah, Fox healing up his team. Enough. Dead Dog's in a lot of trouble right now. He's at 18%. They tried too hard for that. He is going down. Have Bolo picking that kill up. Amazing. Oh, Immortal going to die now. Very low. And he drops. The Ravager is down. Fox is very low, but I mean, I don't see Titch taking them all down. Uh, as good as Titch is. All right, so Fox's team 2-0. Oh, looks like only Titch is left. Titch did fall off the edge, but he's not dead yet. As you can see, it's a very trollsy spot. I've, uh, he probably didn't even... Where, where is he? I don't even... Yeah, you're going to have to pan oh, off yeah, the there. edge. <laughs> yeah, it, it's a very pro spot. I don't know if he did that by accident or if he actually knew that spot was there. Not a lot of oh. people do. Oh! <laughs> Fox's oh, team has lost someone. I mean, um, we have to. What do we What do we do in this situation? I don't even know. It just got swapped up. <laughs> Fox is able to mouse one him. Oh man! And <laughs> it's camo swapped back up top, but have Bolo. <laughs> wow, amazing, amazing. That was crazy. I don't know, man. Uh, I haven't seen anything like that in any of uh, any of the matches we've seen in these yeah. so far. Oh man, really, Trollsy.
If he would have got that, I, I typed in no BM, a tower, you know, to prevent stuff like that, or assassins. 